Hey, you guys. <clears throat> you know, I don't know how that stuck in my head. I think it was an old Cheech and Chong movie. Some girl kept showing up, and every time she'd find them, um, <clears throat> she would say, hey, you effing guys. And it stuck in my head. So, hey, you guys. All right. Hey, this is for Taurus. Um, it's a general reading for Taurus. It's not going to resonate with, uh, with everybody. If it does not, check back. You can also check your uh, sun, your moon, your rising sign. And um, kind of take what resonates. If it doesn't resonate, let it go. Don't try to make it apply. Uh, I have the flashlight set up back there. You can see it kind of uh, flickering and wavering a little bit. Hello, spirit. Thank you for... Um, taking control of the light. It was a little slow uh, for the last couple videos. Sometimes spirit thinks, uh, actually knows that it has more important things to do. Um, and this is a general reading for Taurus. It's the first part of the month. It's, it is the completion of the full moon energy. We're actually, we're still in the energy of the full moon. Um, this is November the 1st, I do believe. Kitty, kitty. Um, you're going to see the camera move, the table shake. Um, you'll see all kinds of things happening. Um, there's there's no, um, no rehearsal. And shit gets real. Um, <laughs> I am, as you can see, up there, um, an old school biker. So sometimes the vocabulary will get a little salty. If it, I am not your cup of tea, I will not be offended. Um, even if I am, I do suggest that you guys check out some other tarot readers also. Um, all tarot readers are not alike. Same way all doctors aren't alike. Um, <clears throat> everybody's got their own methods. Same way every mechanic's not alike. I watch a lot of other readers it is how I've kind of learned this process and the technology that goes with it. Um, I, I'm, I'm a grandmother, kind of slow to um, go with times here. So, all right, one last shuffle for Taurus. No jumpers. We're going to deal. Well, I'm uh, dealing the cards out if I could get you to drop down. Make sure you like the video. Uh, let me know that because then I know what kind of content you need. Also, hit the subscribe button. Thank you, Spirit, on that. Um, hit the subscribe button if you're a first time here to my channel. That also lets me know that you are out there, that you're alive. Okay? Uh, two of Wands, the Magician, Three of Cups, and a Temperance card. Ten of Cups, Nine of Cups, and the King of Wands, Queen of Cups, and the Devil. All right, Taurus, let's see what's going on for you here with this. <clears throat> you on the light back there, Spirit? I do believe the light is on. Uh, the light can go either way, on or off. It is just the fact that uh, they are validating or kind of just interjecting that they are in and on conversation. Um, either on or off is neither a yes or no can go either, either, either way, but you'll know that they are paying attention when the <clears throat> light flickers, turns off or on. Taurus, you're headed for something new yourself. Um, getting ready to start a little bit of celebration and rejoicing. You were, you had somebody that in your life that was very toxic. Um, <clears throat> this could have been a toxic relationship. This could even be a toxic relationship with somebody in a family, but you have cut somebody out. Kind of said, whoa, ho, 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 I'm not doing this anymore. And kind of cut out the um, the crazy behavior. You weren't real sure which direction you wanted to go at first. Um, you knew you had options. You know, you knew you had the whole world was out there, but you 
kind of wanted to hang in there with this situation and see it through. You made a choice to step away from it and um, get away from what feels toxic. Thank you, Spirit on the Light. You have the, let's see, there's a, the King and the Queen. King, excuse me, the Queen of Cups and a King of Wands. Um, let's go with the Queen first. Yeah, you both of these telling me you come in, coming back into your power, uh, back into your own confidence again. You this this uh, toxic relationship really kind of shook you for a while. You kind of didn't know which way you really wanted to go. Um, wasn't real sure. Then you came in. You're coming back into that solid Taurus energy that you ha normally have, and um, kind of decide you're just going to put your foot down and. Um, Kind of like that king with the um, the wand there, man. He's you know he's we're done messing around. Not going any farther with this crap. You cut it out fast and hard. Um, the nine of cups was the almost the completion of a cycle. Um, you're you're not actually completely done with this yet. You're wrapping it up because you already have the ten of cups. Um, that happily ever after card. You're kind of continuing to wrap up some loose ends with this relationship. You're getting ready to allow yourself to really celebrate with that Three of Cups. Um, more social life. This could be somebody else new that may be coming into the picture. Well, I'll pull some clarifiers here in a second and we'll see where this is going to go. But, you know, things are looking up. You chose to step back with this temperance card. Um, that toxic behavior that was ha that toxic relationship was really kind of getting its best in you. And you said, nope, 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 not for me. You're going to step back. Um, you kept patient. And you held your temper, too. Okay. Um, didn't allow that to take over or get the best of you. <clears throat> We also have the Magician card, um, Taurus. You are somebody that knows how to get things done, and that's what that Magician card represents. You're getting back into your um, that King of Wands energy, coming back in. And we, if you follow me, you know that the King is, uh, in this particular case, is not gender-specific. It can be either male or female for you and apply on your end, but it's just the overall energy of where the King of Wands is at. <clears throat> All right, now can we get some, pull a couple clarifiers for Taurus? Um, I often play jumpers, but haven't gotten any today. There we go. You name it, they come. Build it and they come. Let's get hey, one more. Can I have one more, Spirit? Give me one more. One more time. Ah, we'll take it. It did turn over on its own. <clears throat> um, this change may have come out very fast for you, uh, Taurus. You know what? I'm getting a little bit of uh, reflection on that side. Let me go here. Is that any better? Um, yeah, my light might need to turn dial down a little bit. Um, my, my crew's not real good here on the lighting today. Of course, can't see the flashlight. Um, but here we have the chariot card. Uh, that change may have come pretty quick. You um, almost stepping into something that's almost polar opposite of what you were dealing with. You know, you did have a little bit of chaos and mayhem that was going on for a minute with that uh, toxic relationship. But the fact that you stepped away from it, everything's settling down already. It's coming into a peaceful, more calm atmosphere for you. Um, the fact that you're just taking control back over again, and you're also going to continue to come into this energy, Taurus, um, feeling more grounded and more settled. <clears throat> we have the Page of Swords, and that energy is somebody that's, you know, you're, you're, you're kind of expecting something. Thank you, Spirit on the Light. You're still kind of expecting something from this person. Um, they may show up, call up get a hold of you they may um they, they don't feel as though they are done they feel like they've got 
something that is unfinished, no closure, and they kind of feel that things need wrapped up. However, it is coming around. You're coming around the clubhouse turn, riding old Sea Biscuit here, <laughs> and with that six of wands, there is a little bit of success. It is time to relax and have a little bit of a celebration, knowing that you're going to be in better energy now. Uh, Taurus, way to go. Uh, you've taken the right steps and have gone the right direction on this particular case. It is never, ever good to hang out in a toxic uh, relationship. All right, you guys, that is general reading for Taurus. I'm going to wrap it up there. Please like, subscribe, and share the bejesus out of this. Let everybody know about the flashlight, the paranormal flashlight. And um, I never leave you that I don't bless you with love and light. See you all soon.